Hello, and welcome to this Big History course. Now, Big History offers an overview, an overview of all of history from the beginning of the universe right until life on Earth, where we are right here, right now. I'm going to try to explain to you something about our universe that seems absurd. Our universe had a beginning, and that beginning was very extreme. During the first period of our universe, right after the Big Bang, normal matter, as we know it today, did not yet exist. This is probably not something you think about every day, but as I will argue, these massive stars have been incredibly important in our own cosmic history. This is a course about history. So if we talk about the solar system, we should be talking about its history. But can we? How did life emerge on our planet? How was it possible? But it is not true that every trait in an organism must be advantageous and is adaptive. And then all of a sudden, these organisms are wiped out. And that happens exactly at this level. And what's found at this level? That's important. Specifically, it has remained an enigma. Our life, with its capacity to self-organize matter into complex creatures, was able to generate something that seems immaterial, consciousness. What's the use of religion and the history of the human species? I shall be making the point that religion provides communities with a competitive edge in the struggle for survival. And yet, attractively straightforward as this story of global commercial expansion may be, I think it's also a deceptive one. Artificial intelligence is going to impact our world at an accelerating rate. Hopefully, a species that from its rather insignificant place in space and time has been able to uncover the 13.8 billion year history of the cosmos, Earth, life and humanity will also have sufficient cognitive power to deal with the challenges that we will have to face.